Hello everyone, thank you for joining iSpionage today for this short tutorial, Getting Started with iSpionage. We're a competitive intelligence provider focused on helping companies get smarter, faster. Our system provides competitor information that will help you uncover the most effective keywords within your specific market, discover which ads are effective and which are not, uncover whether your competitors are grouping keywords into logical keyword groups, efficiently review landing page designs for improvement ideas, and even deploy competitor alerts to stay on top of your competition and continuously improve. In today's tutorial, we're going to cover off ways to use iSpionage to conduct keyword research to more quickly improve the results of your PPC and organic search marketing efforts. In our last tutorial, we touched on the fact that the point of search marketing is to deliver your message or offer as efficiently as possible to your target audience. If this is the case, then iSpionage can help you achieve this by ensuring that your message is connected to or composed of a broad spectrum of valuable keywords being used by your audience. Our customers tell us that one of the more difficult challenges they faced prior to finding iSpionage was starting from scratch, from a blank page. As any writer will confirm, the blank page can be daunting. With iSpionage at your side, though, you can efficiently glean keyword ideas for your own campaigns from organizations already competing in your space. First, a few core concepts. The logic of our system relies on a few very simple ideas. Generally speaking, Companies expend resources rationally. If they do not, they don't last long. If a company is invested in a keyword for a long time, and they are still investing in the keyword, then the keyword is likely working for them and delivering results. We refer to these keywords as having a high KEI, or Keyword Effectiveness Index. So the idea is that if you have access to your competitor's high KEI keywords and they're useful for them, they are likely to be useful to you to deliver results for your own organization. In other words, the duration and the recency or currency of keyword investments by your competitors can be very good indicators of their inherent value to you. Another core concept that's useful to cover is that keywords fall into a few different categories depending on their degree of specificity. Single word keywords or head keywords often have the highest amount of traffic associated with them. But because of the lack of specificity inherent in single word keywords, they'll have a low conversion rate. At the other end of the spectrum, we of course have long tail keywords or phrases made up of a few keywords, often three or four that have become much more targeted and also have much less traffic associated with them. So single word keywords nearly always deliver too many untargeted clicks and long tail keywords deliver too few highly targeted clicks. But there are keywords that fall in the middle that are sort of just right. The term for these are torso keywords and it's often used to describe these keyword phrases that contain two terms that balance specificity with traffic. Often these torso keywords are characterized by long lists of highly relevant two-word broad match keywords that contain a popular core word as the first word and then a more granular or specific second word. High KEI torso keywords are often useful to understand and consider for emulation. In the following example section of this tutorial, we'll take a look at how iSpionage data that tracks your competitor's search marketing choices and activities can be used to identify useful high KEI keyword ideas that you should seriously consider for use in your own campaigns. We will also show you how Excel can be used to manipulate the data in order to derive useful insights.